What's up, JD Aliens? Oh, come over in here, man. Pull up a chair. Look, I finally did it. I got me some AirPod off knocks. Let's do it. <laughs> yeah, the company's called uh, Off Knock, uh, ironically, and they make an AirPod competitor. Now, y'all know how I feel about iPhone products or Apple products and the AirPods. But I will say that what the AirPods go on for them is that they really do work well with the other Apple products. Now, as far as the sound quality, I'm not really a fan of simply because they don't have the silicone gel tip to stick in your ear. And they kind of sound like garbage, but you know, I don't know, call quality is kind of hit or miss. Um, what else do I not like about those things? Um, typically it's the way they look, but I haven't tried these out because they were called off knocks and I was like, you know what, why not? You know, let, let me get my, my AirPod experience. So yeah, man, I got the AirPods in, man. Yeah. <laughs> I'm doing it. Let's see what else you get in the box before I turn these things on, man. So you get a charging cable. What is this? Is this, oh, it is not USB-C. This is a lightning cable. You see that right there? You get your lightning cable. What is this? Oh, this is like a, a neck band. Let me take one of these out. So I guess, yeah, you stick it in there just like that. Let me get that in there. And then if you put them both on there, that way if you drop one out of your ear, it's not gonna fall off or fall on the ground and you lose it. You can actually use this like a neck band style headphone, which is super cool. Nice. That's a nice addition. I don't know if AirPods actually come with one of these straps, but this is a very nice thing to have. Now let's take a look at the case real quick and then I'll get them turned on and give them a sound sample just to see how they sound. Where'd the case go? Oh yeah, okay. So it really does look like uh, an Apple AirPod case. But once again, these are called off knocks, okay? So <laughs> that's what we're dealing with here. You got your uh, charging port right there, your uh, lightning port. Then when you open it up, they fit in there just like that. Oh, that's kind of a magnet. Yeah, so it's magnetized in there. And you got this magnet, this magnetic clasp on the top. And let me put that one in there just for, yeah, okay. So yeah, we got some AirPod authenticity right there. That's kind of cool. So they look to have all the same kind of things that the AirPods have. You got your connecting pins right there or your charging pins. Then you got your, your speaker and your mics and stuff. I see an LED in there to let you know that it's needing to be paired. Uh, yes, you know what? Let's just get them in my ears. Let's try it out. Hey man, I'm, shit. I'm really, Dang, I am actually really impressed. Now you don't get that fullness because you don't have the silicone ear tip that goes into your ear. Let me pull this out. You don't get that same fullness that you would get from a regular earbud, but for sound quality, you actually do get, I'm gonna say the word bass, okay? But once again, it's not that full bass you get from a sealed ear tip, but you do, you get some good range. Dude, I was really expecting these to sound like garbage, but I, I gotta be honest with you, they do not. They sound fantastic. Wow. Yeah, man. You know, this is not for bass lovers, obviously, because it doesn't have that, that sealed tip, but if you just wanna hear your music on the go and talk on the phone and stuff, which we gotta test that call quality, but the music quality and clarity that I'm getting out of these is uh, is very impressive for what we're talking about here as far as off knocks. Um, and I don't, man, dude, I'm, I'm really shocked. <laughs> I was expecting this to be a bad review. It's not, it's, these, are, these are good so far, very good, but they do have functions. So let's see how these functions work. Let's play. If you touch it, it's supposed to play. Okay, you see that? Yeah, it plays and pause. So a, a single touch is a play and pause. You can hold it to contact Siri or Google Assistant. I think I just turned it off. Nope, that's Google Assistant right there. So you can talk to it. Let me turn it off. And it says if you tap it three times on either ear, like if three times on the left ear, it's gonna raise the volume and three times on the right ear, it will lower the volume. Mine isn't working all the time. I'm more likely to either change the track forward or make a phone call to the last person I talked to. So it's not working that great as far as changing uh, the volume, but for tracks, it works great when you do the double tap. But if you double tap, you can make a phone call, which I'm about to do because we got to test the phone call quality. 
Okay, there we go. So it's actually calling my wife because it was the last call I made. She just picked up. Hey, how you doing? Uh, good. I'm testing out these uh, off knock AirPods or i80s. How does my voice sound? All right, cool. But the quality of the call is like clarity and stuff. Does it sound muffled? I mean, anything crazy going on? Oh, so I actually sound like I'm on a device. Uh-huh. Gotcha. Cool, man. So as you just saw during the phone call, I actually uh, used one of these. I actually put it in here as I was on the phone call and it did not hang up. And that means you can use these independently, which is very cool. So if you're in the market for some AirPod alternatives and you don't want to pay that AirPod price, man, get you some Offnox i80s. Uh, these seem to be a very good competitor, uh, very functional. Uh, maybe you want to do some practicing with the skipping tracks and the volume and stuff like that. But as far as phone calls, they're okay. She, she did say that the call was uh, relatively clear. It didn't sound muffled or anything, but there was a slight buzz. Uh, and that's why I hung up and called her back to see if it would go away. She said it did kind of subdue, but it's still kind of there. So as far as call quality, I would say they're average to good uh, because of what her response was. So yeah, man, the off knock I-80s are kind of a thing now, man. I'm, I'm very impressed. And, you know, I, I thought I was going to hate these, but I, I can't do that because they're actually pretty good, especially for music. I was really shocked with the music quality that came out of here, man. I guess now I get it. So yeah, <laughs> we have off knocks now. Anyways, I ain't no expert in this kind of stuff. I just wanted to showcase these real quick because I was curious. But if you want to hang out after this video, make sure you dig in those links and click on the Instagram one, man. I'm always hanging out there. And if you had a good time checking out the off knock i80s, make sure you throw those emoji hands up in the comment section and I'll see y'all at the next one. Hey, where are you going? No, 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 sit back down. We got to talk about this. You didn't have a good time? All right, then hit the subscribe button. There you go. Reach down there. There you go. And then hit the bell because you need to know when I'm opening up more new stuff. You got to come right back here and check this stuff out. Now, don't you feel like a better human being? All right. I knew you would. All right, man. I'll see you soon. Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Is this not why you are here?